Hello everyone, welcome to Raspberry Pi Made Easy. In this quick tutorial, I'll show you how to connect an ultrasonic set sensor to a Raspberry Pi 5 for measuring distance. First, grab your ultrasonic sensor and four female to male jumper wires. Connect them to the sensor, one for the VCC, one for the trigger, one for echo, and one to ground. Next, let's set up the breadboard. Plug the VCC wire into the positive rail and the ground wire into the negative rail. Now onto the Raspberry Pi. Connect the GPIO 5V pin number 2 to the positive rail using another female to male jumper wire and GPIO ground pin, which is pin six to the negative rail. Time to connect trig and echo. Plug the trig wire to a blank rail on the uh, breadboard. Then from there to GPIO 23 using another female to male jumper wire. GPIO 23 is just pin 16. Next, connect Echo in a similar way to another blank rail, but don't forget to add a 1 kilo ohm resistor between the Echo and the rail. Lastly, link the rail with the 1 kilo ohm resistor to the ground rail using a 2 kilo ohm resistor, then connect the GPIO 24 which is also called pin 18 to the rail with the one kilo ohm resistor. Make sure it's between the one and two kilo ohm resistor. And that's it. You're now ready to start running your code and measuring distance with your ultrasonic sensor. Let's run the script to see if it works. So as you can see, once I run the script, it is measuring the distance from the object that I'm placing in front of the ultrasonic sensor. And it's responding. There's a while loop in the script. So in order to stop the COD from executing, just uh, press Control C. Let's now go over the script that will measure the distance by calculating the time taken for an ultrasonic a pulse to travel from the sensor to an object and back and here's how it works the trigger pulse in the script that you can see would be sending a short pulse about 10 microseconds from the raspberry pi to the trig pin of the ultrasonic sensor this triggers the sensor to send out an ultrasonic wave as for the echo which is used for listening this script waits for the echo pin of the sensor to go high this pin goes high when the ultrasonic wave is emitted and goes low when the wave returns to the sensor after hitting an object. As for the time measurement in the script, measures the time between the trigger and the echo and this time is proportional to the distance traveled by the ultrasonic wave. Lastly, going over the distance calculation and knowing that the speed of sound is about 343 meter per second and the measured time of the script, the script calculates the distance by using the formula that distance is equal to the speed of sound multiplied by time divided by two. The division by two is required because the time measured is for the wave to travel to the object and back. And that pretty much sums up how the script works. I've included the script for you to easily download in one of the links in the description. Thanks for watching and don't forget to like, subscribe and leave any of your questions below.